Section on our productivity tools. So uh, we have a couple of things that work uh, that are built in specifically for final render. We have a HDRI viewer, which uh, you're going to go pick an HDRI that'll suit your lighting in your scene. Um, so it saves artists a lot of time. They'll be able to see what HDR looks like, import it in, and it works with Final Render. Uh, the other thing we have that we're going to be releasing soon is our Asset Manager. So if we were to actually grab an item in our scene, say we're working away and we wanted to um, not go create a whole new scene, not, you know, studio. We just select an object, bring this in. It's going to bring this into a studio scene all set up. We're going to go add in, say, what sort of where it falls into. So we could say, you know, nature, um, trees, go say, we'll call this tree one, add some keywords like forest, uh, comma, tree. Um, it's going to go check the asset. It's going to make sure that there's no problems with it. And then you can export this right out to your uh, 3D file. And then as soon as you exit this, it deletes the studio scene, resets the lightings, resets the render engines or render settings. And then you're back working your scene like nothing has changed. So we have a lot more tools, like I said, coming out for uh, stuff that's compatible with uh, CBUS products. Uh, in the future, we're going to be doing um, our next tab, which is our Ninja, which will be a lot more effects-based tools. So check us out, and thanks a lot. See you guys.